Then the news regarding Todd got worse. Knowing his ankle was injured, Todd had come to Japan looking for points toward making the finals. But after the short, he withdrew, deciding to leave his trip to the finals to a committee decision. So then in the men's free skate, it was Ilya Kulik's turn. And Ilya came in as the leader. It was a great chance to prove that he could win. But halfway through his program, he already looks tired. I have to say, although this man has all the quality that you need to be a champion, he is young, gaining experience, and this could well be a problem with pacing himself. That's why he's tired. And Peter, we've talked about this before. His program is so good with all the connecting steps between the jumps. But if you're not trained and you're not in the right shape, it's very difficult to land those jumps. But we still have confidence in him. He's got a great future, and when he performs this program, there's nobody that can beat him. And how.